That's another thing with Pinochle, is you got to play to win. If I throw a king out, the player to my left has to play either a 10 or an ace. So you always have to play higher than the person before you. Two, two-handed, three-handed, four-handed, five, six, I've even heard of eight-handed Pinochle. You can play either with a single deck of cards, or you can play with a double deck of cards, meaning you have four of everything in your hand. So this is a Pinochle deck. So you got ace, king, queen, jack, 10, nine, and all four suits, two of each. But in Pinochle, compared to other, the ranking of the cards go ace, 10, king, queen, jack, nine. So a 10 is higher than a king. So what they call a rope, some people call it a run. And that basically means you have an ace, 10, king, queen, jack of one suit, all in one suit. If you happen to have the nine in your hand, that's worth an extra point. One ace in every suit, that's called aces around, I mean you have an ace, that's worth 10 points. King in every suit, it's worth eight. Queen in every suit is worth six. A jack in every suit is worth four. Tens and nines around don't count. Why? I don't know, that's just the rules of the game. Um, then of course you have the pinochle, which the game is named after. That is a queen of spades and a jack of diamonds is your pinochle. That's worth four points. A queen of spades and a jack of diamonds is the only way it works. You also have what to call a marriage which is the king and queen of a suit. It's worth two points. If you happen to have the king and queen of the suit that's called Trump, it's worth four points. That's why when you start learning, you have a little sheet like this that tells you what all your Trump is. So you, in each hand, a different Trump suit is called depending on who takes the bid, they name the Trump suit. Always play to win the trick, as long as you can. I'll line it up, and you called spades Trump, so there's two nines, so that's, that's what I have. None. No, Jack yep. of Diamonds. Yeah, Jack hearts? of Diamonds. Jack Diamond. of Diamonds. Yep. Jack of Four plus two is six, six plus two is eight. But when you have no meld in your hand, it's hard to to kind of bid. And then at the Diamond. end, you just count your kings and. Kings, tens, and aces. Tens and first. aces. And they all count as one? Yes. Point? Right. I mean, if this is what we pulled in, we would end up with thir eight and five is 13 plus the last one, we'd get 14. So we actually went set. We'd go negative 25 points okay. off, off of this. The doors are going to open at 8. We start playing at 9.30. It's a $25 entry fee. $5 goes for your lunch. $20 goes into the prize money. It's the first day of pheasant season. I know that. And a lot of people says, well, I'm not going to be there because of pheasant season. But with the weather like we're having, who knows if we're going to go pheasant hunting that day. <laughs>